a scorch. And now I pass the torch. The ballots are in. And one girl has to win. She's perky. She's fun. Dream team, stick together and make history. Golden Hey Dream Team, welcome back to my channel or welcome if you're new here. My name's Eden. Today we are going to be spending a week in my life together. Friendly reminder, if you're not following me on Instagram, head over to my Instagram. You will see lots of fitness and yoga content like you're seeing on your screen right now. I shared all of this on Instagram first. Subscribe to the channel if you're not already. Turn on notifications because I know some of you guys aren't seeing my videos. Grab a snack, sit back and relax for lots of hauls and good vibes. Hi, I hope you're enjoying this vlog so far. I have some packages. The first one, oh wow, is from a company called Boca. I ordered this. It is toothpaste, <laughs> but it has a fluoride alternative that other countries are using. It's supposed to be better for your teeth and keep your teeth in better condition. A lot of people that use this say that every time they go to the dentist, they don't have cavities. <laughs> so. I picked up a sampler pack. I got two different. One is the Element and one is the Cocoa Ginger Toothpaste. It's cocoa nut, not like cocoa, like chocolate. This is what they look like, one of each. And I also got the Tongue Scraper because I wanted free shipping. So this is what the Tongue Scraper looks like from Boca. And I just, like I said, wanted the free shipping and I was already getting the two pack of toothpaste so I just added that in. It's a like totally plastic free, which I thought was nice, like the shipping, obviously the tubes are plastic, but it's good that they didn't do a lot of filler in their packaging. So yeah, I'm excited to try those and it's perfect timing because I just ran out. I also got this package from Tula. I ordered this as well. Um, I had a credit because I didn't like there was something I got, oh, the acne wash. It was a little too harsh for my skin, but I love the moisturizer, so I did a return, which was awesome. And I just used it as a credit, and I got a few things. They have it wrapped really nice, just with paper, though. And I got the No Makeup Replenishing Cleansing Oil. Which looks like this to get off all of my mascara i also got an extra of the sunscreen best sunscreen love this stuff so much so i picked up an extra and i also picked up an extra probiotic because i've been trying out a lot of different ones and the tula ones are still my favorite so i went ahead and repurchased these i'm going to keep trying more brands but i just wanted to have these for the next month to give myself a break on trying new brands these ones are so good the next thing I picked up was a pair of Rika shoes. I picked these up at DSW, and they also have them on the Rika website. These are the Dynamic Pro in black, and I needed a new pair because I had holes in like the top bottom of my shoes because I've had them for over a year. So this is what they look like. They have a little bit of Carol Baskin going on here, and they're just, a super cute simple shoe I really like the Rika shoes because they have the pivot point since I do a lot of dance classes it's really nice to have a pivot point so that you're not turning against your knee with that friction so yeah I got these size 10 super cute I love that they're black but they have like the little bit of animal print under there so I picked those up and will wear those out like I did my current ones. They also have like no grip at the bottom, my current ones. I went to Sephora, VIB sale. You guys know I don't shop for makeup a whole lot. So I got another one of the Laneige, I'm chewing gum, so rude, I know. Um, the Laneige Night Sleeping Mask. There we go, and this is in the Sweet Candy scent. I have the vanilla one. It's been a full year and I'm just now running out of the vanilla one. I think I, well not a full year, I think I got the last one around last June 
and it's lasted me this long which is crazy <laughs> this is what the little pot looks like i want to smell it Ooh, it smells good so i know this will last me at least another six months or so i'm just now scraping like the bare bottom of the other one so i went ahead and replaced it i also got another one of the it cosmetic cc cream in the color rich the reason i get the small one i've talked about this before i don't wear makeup every day i don't wear makeup most days <laughs> and the big container oxidizes so bad but the little one doesn't so i like to get the little one because then i feel like i'm using fresher product um, if I get a little one, run out, get another little one versus using the big one, which oxidizes and then I'm using it for a longer period of time. I may end up spending a little bit, a tiny bit more money, but it just works better for me. I ran to Ulta and got another one of my Lash Princess Mascara. I've loved this mascara for years. The Hourglass is still my holy grail, but um, <laughs> I was getting ready to say I'm on a budget, but like, hello. <laughs> But I'm trying to save money on mascara, so drugstore, since you have to replace it every two months. And then I also got a Fenty Gloss Balm. I usually get either Fussy or Fenty Glow, but this time I got Hot Chocolate, and it's like L-I-T. Come on. Okay, there we go. Hot Chocolate. And hopefully it's not too dark. If it is too dark, then I'll go ahead and take it back and exchange it for Fenty Glow. That's what it looks like. Let's see what it looks like on my lips. Don't be too dark, please. Oh, no, it's not too dark, I don't think. I usually like more of a pinky, but I don't mind this. Let's layer her up. Hmm. Yeah, I like that. We can rock with that for a while, especially in summer as I end up getting tanner. So that was what i got and then i have a shoot and i wanted to have a shirt that said love life on it since my instagram handle is eden loves life so i ordered a couple shirts that said love life like made a couple custom ones and hopefully i like them i got one that i'm gonna crop which is this one so looks like this and i'm gonna crop it right under and then i got a full length one because I don't know which one is going to end up looking better in the picture. So, I got one of each. And this one is colorful. Like this. Pretty. So, we'll see which one I end up liking. This one has larger font because it's not meant to be cropped. But the other one is. So, that's what that is. And yeah. I need to go to Costco now. So, Maybe this is too dark. What do we think? Is it too dark? Let me know in the comments down below. <laughs> I'll probably have taken it back by the time I end up reading the comments, but maybe not. Maybe I like it. I don't know. I feel like maybe it's a little bit too fall to be going into summer. Hey, I just got back from Costco and I did an HB pickup order. My camera's like very crooked right now um just shift your head to the opposite side a little so i went to costco got some stuff did an h-e-b pickup order on the way home from costco so that i didn't have to go to two stores <laughs> it was just easier that way there's a lot of stuff here so i think i'm going to separate it by store and do a face down of each store yeah that's what i'm going to do all right here we go Zero Sugar Dr. Pepper came out. I wanted the original, but they gave me cherry, which is fine. And then this is the cream soda one. I love a good diet soda every once in a while. I have two things of egg whites, two things of, are these turnip or mustard? I can't tell. Uh, they look like mustard greens. I think they are, yeah, mustard greens. Two things of turnip greens one thing of heinz zesty cocktail sauce and two things of my favorite hidden valley greek ranch this stuff is so dang good i love it way more than the bolt house one which i know a lot of people rave over they used to have a dill version of this like dill greek ranch 
haven't been able to find it anywhere, so maybe they don't make it anymore. That's what happens when I love something. So this is all from H-E-B. Now for Costco, we have some lettuce, some tomatoes, mushrooms, asparagus, some sweet uh, red in many colors, not just red, lots of colors, bell peppers, cucumbers, some hand-pulled rotisserie chicken, some Mateo salsa, oh, it's so good, and it's local, Austin, well, not Austin, Texas. Um, some pre-cooked shrimp so that I could have some shrimp cocktails. This honey looked so good. I It's like in the comb. Savannah Honey Co., I think it was what it was called. This is what it looks like. It's very bad lighting today because it's rainy outside. So I figured I'd never go through both of them, so I'll give one of them to my mom. Envy Apples two cantaloupes, some organic chunky guacamole. I haven't gotten this in so long, but I figured I would, and some brownie brittle. And that is everything from Costco this time around. Non-fat yogurt, two scoops of the Vital Proteins collagen. You know, it gets stuck around the edges. Um, a pump of this. And I'm going to crumble up a little bit of brownie brittle on the top. Oh my gosh. So I did end up taking back that lip gloss. And when I went to return it, I was just going to get the Fenty Glow, the regular one. But then I saw that the Fenty Creams came out. I mean, they could have come out a long time ago. I don't go in Sephora like ever. And they had it in the Fenty Glow color, so I'll swatch it. And then while we were in line, they gave us these samples of the Biosant Squalene and Tea Tree Cleansing Gel, which I'm almost afraid to use because squalene's one of my favorite ingredients ever. So is tea tree oil. So I feel like I'm gonna love it so much and then be really upset because I know Biosant is very expensive. I haven't actually looked at the price. I should look at the price before I say that, but I'm pretty sure. So I'll show you what this looks like. It's so pretty and it's like definitely my color. Sorry, the sun's going down. It's not like super bright in here, but very much Eden, right? And then she gave me two samples. I did not ask for the Estee Lauder, but she was like super talking me into it. I just wanted a sample of the Urban Decay Hydro Maniac um, it's like a skin tint because it's like a lighter coverage version of the It Cosmetics. And she's like, I don't think you're going to like it. It's too light coverage. And I was like, no, that's why I want it because the It Cosmetics is too heavy of coverage and I really have to work to sheer it out. And she's like, well, the Estee Lauder's right in the middle. I know you'll love it. I'm just going to give it to you. So anyhow, I have these two samples of the Urban Decay Hydromaniac and the Estee Lauder Futurist Hydra Rescue. So... Yeah, I'm going to try those out over the next couple of weeks. I also got this Disney shirt. It says Disney and then the arm says Lane. <laughs> what? Did I just like short circuit? Um, I was excited. Uh, the arm says land. And then this arm has the Disney castle. I love it. It's so cute. I got it at the actual disney store i was at the outlets last week because i had a dance class near there and i love it i actually went for a torrid but it, i think it got closed that one so yay cute disneyland shirt i feel like i'm gonna get a lot of wear out of this it's so adorable disney we love it this little cheese plate thing that i got at williams sonoma like years ago is still one of my favorite things i can like sit on the couch and then have my drink not fall over it's amazing making a couple different toasts for breakfast this one's gonna have smoked salmon and egg this one will have well obviously it has refried beans on it and an egg for breakfast this morning i'm gonna go ahead and top them and then i'll show you and there they are they're all done eggs are Perfect. Look at that. Yum. I know you guys love some yolk porn. <laughs> and that's breakfast today. Cardboard box under my bed. So I went to the Asian market and I got some red shrimp. It was on sale for $5.99 a pound, which is insane. And then I got three packs of enoki mushrooms, which they used to be four for a dollar. Now they're a dollar each, which is insane. 
some oyster mushrooms. This was an impulse buy. These are churro flavored Cheetos. Had to try it. And some xylitol gum. And then I got a couple packs of noodles too. I got the soon veggie, which is my favorite. Um, I can't eat the soups on either one of these because they both have soy, obviously, you know. Um, but the air-dried noodles are really good and they're pretty low in points and I like the noodles in this too. So I got two things of noodles and then I ran to Costco. So I went to Costco because I was out of yogurt. <laughs> so I went and grabbed another one. I grabbed this giant size of sliced pickled jalapenos because you know the obsession is real. I didn't, I've never seen these at my Costco. I went to a different Costco today because I was on a different part of town. Um, organic sun-dried figs. I had one in the car. It was so good. There's no sugar added and they're unsulfurated. I don't know what that means, but it's probably a good thing. I got this um, turkey that was on sale <laughs> that I saw at Flav City. It's like, you know, the good stuff. And then I got some pasture-raised eggs. My Costco also does not have the pasture-raised. They only have the cage-free. And then I got some Brazil nuts because one Brazil nut has your daily needs for selenium. So I figured I'd pick those up, have a Brazil nut a day like I used to. And yeah, then I did run over to Sir La Taube and got these matcha pods. Um, I ran out of matcha. I used my last one during my last video when I made my matcha latte. So I picked up these Republic of Tea pods for my Nespresso machine. I hope that they're good because um, I got two of them. And then I picked up this little sponge too. It's a silicone sponge and it has the soft side for nonstick and then it has like the scrubby side as well. So hopefully this works well and will save me on buying sponges for a while. So that, that's all folks, that's all. Morning, I have three minutes to leave for the gym in order to set up my allergy pill. Wasting time, Lululemon Define, fast and free. And I need water, and then I need water for my BCAAs. It's been a minute and 17 seconds. The gym that I'm going to is like not close to my house at all, so. And I need to set up my weights, like I said, so I need to be there like 10 minutes early. It starts in 30 minutes. I'm gonna use a scoop of the peach ring, Milani New, the BCAAs. I like to drink it while I'm lifting weights so that I'm not as sore the next day. And then I'm gonna put some of this Oleo coconut water in it too, just for like extra hydration. So one of those and one of these. And this doesn't have any added sugar. It just has the sugar from the coconut water. And then I need some ice for my protein shake to drink on the way home because I work out fasted unless I'm working out in the afternoon. Well, in the afternoon, it's still fasted. Not technically fasted, but I don't eat a meal before because I get all burpy and sickly feeling. So got that. Put some... Um, this is water from yesterday. We put some ice in here. Chocolate was the first one that came out, so that's what I'm having. Fair life. I'm gonna put this in here. It's hot in Texas, so that's why. And then. I don't know if this is pre-workout or pump or uh, this is pre-workout. So I'm going to go ahead and dry scoop this so I'm good when I'm ready. Um, I did see a girl on TikTok that had a heart attack from dry scooping because she wasn't used to caffeine. So I say just follow the instructions on the bottle for any supplement unless you're one of us. I made it <laughs> to the gym with like four minutes to set up my weights which is great which means that i probably sped it's cold we got a cold front it's like 49 today which is cold for texas i wore this athleta athleta whichever tank underneath and just so you guys know if you are a fitness professional like me 
Um, you get 25% off at Lululemon, and I think it's 20% off at Athleta. You just go up to the front, you show your class schedule or wherever you teach online, and you're like a fitness pro, so you get a discount. So I get 25% off at Lululemon and 20% off at Athleta. So just so you know that, it's a great deal if you're a fitness pro of some kind. I'm going to make that matcha. You know, I got that matcha from Sir Latab yesterday. So I'm gonna make a matcha after I get out of the shower. I guess I'll go take a quick shower. I was trying to decide if I was gonna wash my face and shower <laughs> later because I do plan on recording a yoga video and I'm just gonna get sweaty again. So I don't know, we'll see. I think, I think I'm just gonna go shower and then make some breakfast. It's 11 o'clock so it's more like brunch. All right, I'm getting ready to make this. I feel like a mouseketeer today. Coming up next on Disney Channel. Is that how a mouse looks? Definitely not. I'm gonna do a couple pumps of coconut. Oh, I should probably turn on my machine. Did I do two or three? I don't know, you guys probably heard the sounds. Ice. Ice, baby. Almond milk. Should be good and these pods are aluminum just like the regular Nespresso pods there's a different brand that sells matcha but their pods are plastic Let's see how this turns out hopefully it's good Ew. looks fine One shot, two shots. That's what it looks like so far. I wonder if one shot would have been fine, but I'm gonna go for two. Looks like matcha. I'm gonna run just one shot to clean it. Isn't that pretty? I love a good matcha shot. This straw is very big for this cup. It's not as bright green as like the other matcha powder I use, but let's see how it tastes. Tastes like matcha. <laughs> This will probably be the end of this video. I don't actually know what else I've recorded for this week, <laughs> but thanks for hanging out with me. I love you bunches. I'll talk to you soon. Get out there and love life. Bye.